What is up, guys? It's DJX, and welcome to another episode of our Climb to 500, the model type ladder. It's been a while, but hopefully you guys have read my little update about how things are going to run on this channel. I think it's going to be really beneficial to both of us. So I think, honestly, we can just you know, have a... We have an okay channel without any problems. But yeah, I'm using steel type. This is one of my favorite types to use. And we're just going to try to keep going. I'm trying to have as much wins as possible. Or just at least try to win as much. And yeah, that's going to be my objective for this episode, basically. Is to try to win as much as possible. And the thing is, because the more we win, I mean, it's pretty obvious, the more we win, the more we can get close to getting to 500, which after all is the objective of the series itself. Anyways, our, we have wild cards going to be bronze long, and it looks like we did pretty good. We're actually a bulky variant, and that's good. So I guess we're just all going to set up our screens. And... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Alright. So, wow. That skunk tank is going to go down to a bullet. That's actually really surprising. I w you would expect, of all things, that to go down to a bullet punch. But now, I'm going to have to get up my screens in order for Excadrill to sweep this guy. Clefable is going to come out. That scares me a lot. Because it is unaware. Yup. Okay, so we gotta really gotta do something about that. That's gonna, I want I want us to get sweep now because that's gonna be a problem. He's gonna bring Golark right back in, forty two percent. It wasn't gonna do a lot anyways. Let's be real. I mean, yeah, I couldn't send in Bashar, but I just needed. I didn't really. I mean, I did, and I didn't need Magnazone at that point. No, I'm probably gonna regret it, but I'm actually. Just kind of glad. Okay, he has three more turns. We just need to get a flinch. That's all we need to get off is a flinch. And instead of that, we are close. And I'm praying this bullet punch will knock out this Clefable. All right, perfect. Woo. He is going to bring in. and All right, so he's going to double switch into his Jellicent. And... The thing is, I gotta. I don't need Scizor, but then I do. I, I just need him. To, I need to use him just to, you know, safely switch into Bisharp without getting burned by Scald. Alright, so it looks like. I'm gonna use Bullet Punch and Super Bower, which both of them aren't gonna do a lot, anyways. We really need Swords Dance, yeah. I can just tell we're not it really isn't gonna matter at that point. Cause that Jelson is gonna be pretty hectic Pokemon to get around. Cause Jelson alright, wow, that's actually what we needed. Okay. It would just go for knockoff. And then we should be able to win. He's gonna switch into the blade. The blade is gonna take about Yeah, about I'd say yeah, 69% of damage, about 68. It's going to go down to a Sucker Punch, and we are, it's tied 3-3. Three to three, But hopefully the battle is in our favor. And now Venusaur is going to come out. I have to go for an Earthquake, and this should be able to KO it, unless that's Protect or whatever. No, but it is going to go for Giga Drain. All right, that's a problem. I think I just need to... Yeah, I should just keep it out. And now, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I need to preserve extra drill for now, and just use Iron Head, or just keep spamming it, because that's pretty much gonna. All right, so we need a flinch. Nope, we're not gonna get a flinch, unfortunately. Our right, Hoopa is gonna come out. Sucker Punch, KO, KOs, it. and now. 
what we're going to have to do is pretty much just go all out. You know, we're going to have to. All right, that's, that's going to be a pro. Wow, I, that's going to be really bad problem. And so the next thing I'm going to need to do. I'm not coming out. And so we're back. And I'm going to go for a flash cannon. He's going to forfeit. I'm a weak player, but you're using ghost. Okay. No offense to ghost, though. It's one of my favorite types. I'm a weak player. I'm just using strategy. Ooh, okay. It's gonna be a problem. All right, that's good. Perfect, right there. But I don't think our gyro ball is gonna do anything. Nope. <sighs> but he's kind of stuck. He needs to go down to a sucker punch. However, I have a feeling he has substitute. No, he's just going to send him to his Venusaur. And. Just going to. Oh, Babiri. Wow, that's. <laughs> Babiri Berry. Wow. That's nice. I like that. I didn't see that coming at all. Now he is going to bring in his Dianti right back out. We are going to go down to an Earth Power. Now we can just hopefully set up. We can just win with Bronze on. And that's going to be that battle. Uh, synthesis. You would. You would. You would. Okay. Uh, all right. Good. He got this death drop. And he's going to bring his Tentacruel. And I still need Excadrill. I just need more firepower. Because that Venusaur is not going to go down easily. It won't. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's not going to go down easily. Because that's Synthesis, and it's at 93. So... I need Rapid Spin on Excadrill to get rid of rocks. Then again, we are a Steel type, so I think I'm just going to put Sword Dance on. Or I could put Home Claws for the uh, Rock Slide. Yeah, I think Home Claws would be better. Because maybe we're still going to get the Attack Boost either way. And this Rock Slide is 100%. Let's look for another battle, actually. Just try to keep this going. All right, looks like you got Bug is up next. Mm, or really skip at the Vivalon. You have to get that out of the way ASAP. Because that's going to be a bit of a problem. All right, so now we just need Excadrill to clean up. Or at least try to clean up, I should say, the rest of this guy's team. Yeah, see? Rock slide hits. Wow, all right. Perfect. There we go. There we go. It looks like we are going to go to an earthquake our own. It looks like he wins pretty much. So, yeah, good game. Man, we are not doing so well, are we? Hopefully, we can wake up. Cause I think he really only has... I need to go for Rock Slide, not Iron Head. I think he using Sleep Powder on Vivalon to go into Volcarona, and he does outspeed, does he? Yeah, but I'm guessing he's going to try to sweep us, because then he can. We just need to wake up. There we go. We hit the Rock Slide. Volcarona goes down, and he's going for All right, come on. You had a chance. 
hopefully making a comeback. All right. Fighting, okay. I need focus. This is going to be a pretty tough battle. Trakion is a big threat. Infernape. I mean, they're all big threats, but I just don't have really one way to sweep them all. That's the problem I have. So I'm going to have to take them on bit by bit. And just try to work my way around. And Bronzong is going to be our best bet. Because it's going to be our protection. I can sweep with Scizor, however. I don't know how much plus six bullet punch would do in front of it. That's even if we get to plus six. I don't even know how much that's actually going to do. Because that's really going to be our only way to win. Now that I think about it. Alright, looks like he's overheat. Still, still a chance of losing. And we got Ghost Ugg once again. Ah, come on. He has a sash. Oh my god, he would. And just to get rid of one Pokemon too, wow. Come on, man. Are you serious? I'm just going to set up once again another uh, Swords Ant. And I got to switch. Alright, now let's see what will happen. Shouldn't front it come out. I, oh, come on. 93. 90, are you serious? 93%. Oh, my God. So close. And then, yeah, you would go for self -run. Can't even. Wait, that's okay, I got rock slide. Oh, did I go? Ooh, did not mean to go for that at all. Hmm. Just not what I wanted. 
Then again, some things aren't meant to be. I mean, it's pretty obvious we're going to lose here, so I think I'm just going to end it for this this part of the episode. Or that, or this part of the series. Thanks for watching. I'm trying to put up another one. I don't even want to end it like this. But thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.